First is this print, which I think is my favorite one. I honestly love it so much and I really like the paper. And then I've also got this moth. Um, then a little beetle. The mushroom I painted a few videos back. And another moth, which I also really like. I think they all turned out so well and I'm so happy with them. It looks a bit dark now, but it is a bit lighter in real life. And then also, I got some stickers. I didn't want to make whole sticker packs because for one, I don't really have the money to make them as often as I would like. And second of all, it's just a lot of work, but I wanted to make a new sticker and yeah, sunflowers are my favorite flowers. They have always been my favorite flower and yeah, I was like, why have I never made a real sunflower sticker or product or anything? I even have a sunflower tattooed on my arm, <laughs> which yeah, I still really like it. <laughs> but um, yeah, and all these little stickers I put in because I always put stickers on the envelopes I send orders in and, and I can also just give some away when people order things. So yeah, I think I'm gonna cut these out now, which I'm honestly excited about. So yeah. Hello, I think I haven't said this yet, but welcome to my new video. As you can see, I made some new products for in my Etsy store and I'm gonna cut these stickers now. Also, really random, but I got a haircut and it's so much shorter. I don't know if you can really tell, but like I cut about this much off, which is quite a lot for me. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy with it and it feels really healthy again. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna cut these stickers now. I never really know where to start, honestly. Um, yeah, in my last video where I talked about cutting stickers, I actually got a lot of comments about like how I could do it as well, and I really appreciate it. Um, but the fact is that I can't really afford like a cutting machine for stickers, even though I would really like it to. Um, and I know I can order stickers and they cut them out for me, but it's also quite expensive. And I don't really have the money for that, so it's a bit of a shame, but I actually don't really mind cutting them out. Um, I think it's a nice activity. I mean, it does take a lot of time and, you know, in that time I could be painting as well, as some people said. And I know that's true, but yeah, I don't know, like, for now I think this is okay, but once I got like a bigger studio and I do have more money to spend then I'll probably invest in like a cutting machine or something but for now this is fine <laughs> also I went camping last week which was really nice I actually never went camping before <laughs> and I don't really know why but yeah I really loved it I wouldn't expect to be like that comfortable sleeping outside basically but yeah I really enjoyed it and now I just want to go camping again also I have been looking into making pins but it is such a struggle like for one, they are really expensive to make and I wouldn't really mind investing in them, but at the same time, it is really expensive. But yeah, I would just love to make something like a pin. I think it would be such like a cool product, you know? These are kind of hard to cut out, by the way. <laughs> But yeah, as I said, I went camping and I think 
when I'm done cutting stickers or I mean not when I'm done done but when I just don't feel like it anymore I'm gonna paint some things that I found because I went on a little hike with my boyfriend and we were stopping I think like every 20 seconds and he was kind of annoyed with me but <laughs> But yeah, um, I did take a lot of pictures of things to paint and I'm really excited too. So I think I'm going to do that today as well. But yeah, we'll see. I don't think I will be able to take pictures for my Etsy store already because the weather is really good today, which I'm loving. But yeah, i rather take pictures when it's a bit cloudy, you know, because now there will be a lot of shadows and stuff and, and it makes it really hot to take pictures so I think tomorrow will be cloudy so I'll take pictures tomorrow it's fine and yeah that I got so far it's not like too much but I am pretty sure that it will be enough for now so yeah and these are all the ones that I have left which are quite a lot but I'm sure that I will sell like lots of them at the same time so I will have enough for now so I can just like go slow on these which is nice so yeah my hair isn't the only thing that's burning today <laughs> oh I need to stop do a little voiceover for this bit um, because otherwise it's quite boring to watch and I haven't talked much in this video I feel like. Also I just put up my new stickers and prints in my Etsy store so if you want to take a look the link of my shop is in the description. Um, but yeah I was 
kind of struggling with this painting actually and I feel like I've been saying that a lot lately. I don't know what it is but every time I start a new painting I don't feel very like confident about it. The thing with painting is that you just need to build up layers and and the first layers just don't look very good most of the time at least for me. <laughs> so yeah, I was not really liking this painting until like the very last moment. I still haven't finished it completely. Um, I still want to add some details and stuff, but but I am more happy with it now. Like after painting for a few hours, I just wanted to leave it alone and continue when I felt like it a bit more because I had been painting for like four hours that day or something. So yeah. Yeah, as I said, I am struggling like a little bit with this painting. Also, I find painting leaves and flowers so hard, like I don't know what it is. I'm very like comfortable with painting like moths and beetles and things like that, but when it comes to like plants and flowers and stuff like that, I just, I don't know, like I can draw them and do illustrations with pen or ink like I'm fine with that but painting I just find it kind of tricky honestly but yeah that's why I wanted to do more paintings of flowers and leaves which I am doing now that my summer break kind of started which is exciting <laughs> so yeah as I mentioned earlier in this video I went camping and we were surrounded by woods, so there were a lot of ferns, and I don't know what it is, but I think they always look so beautiful, and I really want to get a tattoo of a fern one day, like maybe on my leg or something, or maybe just my arm, I don't know, but I really want one. <laughs> and I did a few illustrations of them with ink, but I never really painted one, so I really wanted to do a painting of a fern, and yeah, I'm finally doing it. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know what else to say really, so I think I'm just gonna leave you with this and put some music in the background so yeah, you don't hear me rambling anymore. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed the rest of this video and also please subscribe to me if you haven't yet because it really means a lot to me. Also, if you have any ideas for a video or like a video you want to see, please let me know because I am kind of running out of inspiration, like not really, but yeah, it would be great to record something that you would like to see and I will actually listen, so if you have any suggestions for a video, please let me know and yeah, enjoy the rest of the video. Bye!